Hello, everybody. Welcome to Master Flames Pick a Die. This is Pick a Die number six. Yes. So, I just got done doing some shadow work, right? Man. If you don't know what shadow work is, I suggest you Google that. Look it up. It's not what you think it may be. You know, something dark, evil, or something like that. No. It is dealing with inner healing. Letting go of things, regrets, shame, et cetera, et cetera. Look it up. Do some yourself. It's wonderful. It's invigorating. Yeah. It's painful, too. Because, like I said, you're... Digging deep within and bringing out old things, old emotions that you've been holding on to and stuff. So you kind of like feel some type of way when it when it's coming out. But that's all right. Let it go. Let it go. It's okay to feel some type of way. We talked about this before. But anyway, y'all, we about to get started. I want y'all to pick y'all a color. We got black. We got red. We got caramel. And we got metallic silver. Go ahead, choose you a color. And do know that you can go to the description. And from there, you can go ahead and pick whichever part of the video you want to go to. It'll take you right there. You can pick black, red, caramel, metallic silver. Y'all go ahead and choose. While we get ready. All right, we're going to start off with black. Yes, we are. So we're going to go ahead and roll to that. Pop those in there. All right. Black, how y'all doing? Sorry, I got quiet on y'all. It's up here getting ready. We got the number three. We got the number nine. And we got the number three. Well, we got double digits right there with the nine in between. Let me move that closer so y'all can see that. See your numbers. Nine. Three. Three, nine, three. All right. With the number three. We've talked about before, it's the number of creativity. It's the number of the child. This is where mother and father come together and their energies are one with the number three. It's an active number. Whereas you got the number nine. The number nine is the number of divinity. We all like that though. That, that term, divinity, right? Is the number of endings. And with endings comes new beginnings. Always new beginnings when we have endings. And then, of course, at the end here, we got the number three again. So we have the three appearing twice with the number nine. And the angel number nine, three, nine. Angel number three, nine, three. Let me slow myself down, y'all. Brings a message from the angels to take some time out of your daily life to meditate and steal the mind in order to receive clear divine and angelic guidance in regards to your spiritual career and practice and divine life purpose. Angel number 393 is a message to let go of any situations in your life that are no longer positively serving you. Allow the old to lead your life and do not cling to situations out of fear. It is most important that you hold a positive viewpoint and have high expectations about yourself and your future. Our thoughts create our experiences and we create our own realities. So ask your angels to help you maintain a positive outlook. Do not allow any negative aspects to hinder you or stop you. Your angels encourage you to... Sorry. I'm moving too fast, y'all. My my words is 
trying to come out faster than uh, uh um ooh. Let me take a moment to breathe. That's what we're supposed to do right here. We're supposed to take a moment to breathe, y'all. We're breathing. Breathe out slowly through your mouth. Breathe in slowly through your nose. Ooh. All right. Relax. This ain't my energy. I'm feeling it right here. Right now, within this group, is anxiousness. There's there's energies of worry. Ain't no need to be worrying. Your angels are with you to protect you, to guide you, and support you. You want to understand what it is that you need to be doing. But there is an abundance of positive energies around you at all times. We we gonna um go to the butterfly cards, y'all. Boom. I'm gonna shuffle those up for you. Mm -hmm. It says support. The angels are supporting you. You have support. There are those that can reach out and guide you and, and help you in your circle. You just gotta ask for that help. Don't be afraid to ask for help, y'all. Cause it's out there. It is. Sometimes we wanna always do things ourselves. Master Flame talking to himself right there on that one. But it's okay. It's okay to, it says leap. It's like it leaped right out of the deck on us, y'all. It says leap. You go first. The universe will catch you. <laughs> Don't be afraid to go out there and do what it is that you need to do. The universe is out there with you. It will protect you. And it will guide you. You feel me? I know you feel me. I'm going to pull one more card for y'all. Make sure everybody get the advice that's needed today. This one says, Furry and Feathered Friends. So, those of you that got your little pets, or family members. Cuddle up with them. You don't have any, go spend some time out in nature. Watch their movement, watch their actions. It'll take your mind off of things that are necessary and help you to connect back to it yourself. The one you should be loved in all ways. Well, y'all, I really don't want to cut our time off, but I got to. The other groups need me. So, remember that Master Flame loves you unconditionally. Love like always. Sit down and meditate. The answers that's necessary are right there inside of you. Everything outside of you is just confirmation. Remember that. Love light always. Master Flame out. Rosie Red. Y'all ready? I know y'all ready, Rosie Red. I like that Rosie Red. Those energies are like, ooh. Let me feel right. In tuned. All right. Those just came out there. Quiet, interesting set of numbers. Rosie Red. You guys got zero, uh -oh. zero, one, zero, zero, one. <laughs> Basically, you guys got the double what? This is the number zero is everything and all things. 
Everything derives from the number zero. You can't have the number one without the number zero being its beginning. The number zero can increase the value or minimize the value, minimize certain values, certain characteristics of numbers. It's all determining what number uh, we're dealing with. But angel number one, or zero, zero, one, it means that you are connected with your angels and ascending masters. You are into the energies of self. You understand what it means to make you, you. You don't really need my saying that you are awesome, but I'm quite sure you like me saying that you guys are awesome, okay? Because you are, you know? But angel number 001 encourages you to look at, at new beginnings, opportunities, and projects with a positive and optimistic attitude, as these are appearing in your life for a very good reason. Your angels want you to achieve and succeed with your desired goals and aspirations, so do not hesitate in taking positive steps and striving forward. Do not allow fears, doubts, or concerns to hold you back from living and serving your divine life. So, I guess y'all just got to go out there, continue doing what it is that you got to do. Don't stop. Don't stop. Well, <laughs> before you go, let me uh give you a little advice, you know, that your spirit guys got for you. Because I know that y'all ready to get out there and go get it done. Rosie Red is about getting it done because color red is about action. You know what I'm saying? Uh-oh, look at that. Be true to you. Be true to you. When the number one is about self. So, I don't think that we going to have a concern at all about you all being true to you. Not will we. No, y'all going to always be true to you. We going to get y'all some more advice before we let y'all go. Because I know y'all ready to go and get it done. Y'all ready. And I ain't about to stop y'all. See? I'm done. Oh, my goodness. Okay, uh, I believe that this is a deep message here. You guys got the card leap. You go first. The universe will catch you. And I'm also starting to believe that the, the multiverse is talking to me as well, y'all, because uh, the last group got that card and it leaped out of the deck just like it did. Well, not exactly the same way, but it leaped out. That is amazing. Guys, you go ahead. I'm not about to hold y'all up. Y'all know the message. Get out there and get, get it done. Magic Flame loves you unconditionally. Love light always. Peace out. Metallic Silver, are you ready for this? Are you ready for this? I am. Why are we getting it done? Yes. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Vibrant energies. Yes. Y'all see my abundance tree? Yes, I send abundance energies out to you as well. Metallic silver, you got four. One, zero. I just went quiet, like, I've been going quiet today on people. I don't know why. I, I have no idea, dude. No reason for me to be going quiet. I like talking. I, anybody who know me know I love talking. But anyway, y'all got the number four one zero. Matter of fact, you just seen how I just started rambling, all right? Cause master flame like talking. Anyway, y'all, I love y'all. Glad that you are here and you come to get your angel number reading within this pick a die plus a little advice from your higher ups meaning your ascended masters, the guardian angels and all that, your higher self always got something to say to you because you got things on your mind. You, you want to know? 
Is this what I need to be doing? Is this where I need to be going? Am I on the right path? Let's find out. Angel number 410 is a message that the angels are available to assist you with your positive thoughts, wishes, and desires. It is a message from your angels to remain very aware of your reoccurring thoughts as the angels counsel you to make thoughtful and meaningful wishes at the moment as they are being manifested in your life. Your will and effort as well as the energies of your angels who will bring about what you have been working towards. This number tells you that your thoughts are rapidly manifesting into material form and you are asked to keep a positive and optimistic attitude and outlook to ensure that you manifest good into your life. Trust that your determination and hard work will bring you your desired results and the plans you have put into action will bring success and fulfillment. Angel number 410 indicates that the angels are assisting you with aligning your vibrations with your life purpose and soul mission. Trust the work you are doing now and have done in the past will reap rewards as you serve your divine purpose. Yes. Man, get out there and do it, y'all. Shed your love light to others because people need it. I be needing that love light. You know, my battery be you know, going down sometimes and I got to recharge. You know, so if I'm around other light beings, you know, I can run charge even faster. So it happens. All right. Here's a little advice for y'all. It says changing your mind. Changing your mind. So. Are, are some of y'all dealing with that? Your plans ain't going exactly like you want. You might need to change your mind a little bit. Or are you dealing with indecisiveness? You can't decide what to do. Well, this card right here is the warrior woman. And it says, have answered, have you answered your deepest calling? Have you answered your deepest calling? I'm feeling inclined to draw y'all another card from this day. Have you answered your deepest calling? I don't know, my face just popped on the screen. I had to get closer to that card to read it. The light is glaring on it. Warrior one. What this one is, y'all? Boundaries. This is the boundaries card. Where do you need to establish better boundaries? Where do you need to establish better boundaries in your life? Only you would know that. You're going to have to set them. You want to know how to move forward? You got to set boundaries. You got to ask yourself, what is your deepest cause? Have I completed it? Am I doing anything towards it? Only you got to answer to that. Master Flan can't answer that. But I can tell you this. You got all the answers within you. Take a little time to meditate. You'll find out. And draw this last card for y'all. Home. Home. Is there an issue at home? Home needs to be in order. Is it your inner home that's out of order? Your heart chakra? Master Flame sends you love and light. Always. I want you to take time and meditate and ask yourself, where do I need to set boundaries? Am I working on my life purpose? Take time to do that, y'all. Sorry to be all serious on y'all, but you know how it goes. What's real is real. 100. 
I love y'all unconditionally. And I'll catch y'all later. Love light always. Peace out. Caramel. 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 Turn up. Turn up. I'm saying caramel. Caramel. Turn up. Turn up. Turn up. Y'all with me? Oh, I know y'all did. Turn up, y'all. What we got going on? I know y'all ready for this excited weekend. Six, five, five, six, five, five. A lot of activity here, y'all. We're looking at a lot of activity in this number. This number five is a very active number. Is it just going to be a very active weekend, too? You know what I'm saying? And then number six deals with family. Oh, ain't this the kind of weekend where we going to be around close friends and family? Yes, it is. Yes, it is. Right on time for us to be getting this message, right? I know it. That's why we in here, Caramel. 655 suggests that major changes are taking place in your life, and you may be feeling apprehensive or anxious about what is ahead of you. Know that these changes are happening to advance you along your life path and soul mission. You are encouraged to take full advantage of the changes and new opportunities that come with them. Your prayers and positive affirmations have manifested these much-needed changes, so trust that they are right for you. Angel number 655 encourages you to bring some fresh new energies into your home and family environment environment and or start a project related to something that you are truly interested in you can also expect some positive new additions to your home and or family life mm, i like that kind of news who about to have a baby oh did i just break some news y'all y'all is somebody about to have a baby or somebody around y'all about to have a baby I probably just told y'all a secret. My bad. <laughs> yeah. Anyway, y'all, you can expect some new additions to your home and or family life and some great news coming your way as your life, as you live your life to your own values and personal spirituality, the angels and universal energies will ensure that all your needs are taken care of, leaving you free to pursue the course of action that takes you closer to living your personal truths. Man, Caramel, I love y'all. I love y'all. Y'all about to go out here and get some things done in your home, making life more blessing, more of a blessing, making yourselves more prosperous. Yes, I feel free flowing energies with y'all. Oh my goodness. I said free flowing energies. Look at that. Sobriety. Sobriety. Oh my goodness. That means, you know what I'm saying? Free minded. You know what I'm saying? No blockages. Nothing, nothing preventing your mind from seeing clearly. Uh, it don't just mean, you know what I'm saying? Oh, I ain't been drinking. It's, it's the freeing, the clearing of the mind. Like what we're talking about here. Keeping that mind clear. Clear of your home, clear of your heart. Let the love in, and it's gonna come to you in abundance. I got a card, one more card to draw for y'all. And this is, oh my goodness. This is Anna, grandmother of Jesus. Seeding the light, laying foundations, divine plan. Whoa. Man, there are major changes taking place in your life, angel number 655 said, and it looks like G-Mama coming to send divine love, light, energies into your life to aid in this change. Man, you guys are blessed in this group today. We're going to take a moment, take a deep breath, like, and through the nostrils. And out of our mouth. We 
We got a being of high divinity here with us. Speaking to y'all. Letting y'all know that she's with you. She is with you. I, I'm going to draw this next card because I'm feeling compelled to y'all. It says, let y'all see that picture. And it says, unbound. Releasing soul patterns, contracts, and past lives. So as you end off this year, you're ending off contracts. Yay. Love light always. Yes. Taking that deep breath right there, y'all. And slow through the nose. I slow through the mouth. Yes. Let go and let love in. Let go of the old and let the new love in. I love y'all unconditionally. Master Flame out. Peace. Love light always, y'all. <laughs> Peace out, y'all.